male reproductive system of a frog. Frog is unisexual and shows sexual dimorphism. In the male frog, two vocal sacs are present, one on each side at the junction of the jaws. These are responsible for the croaking sounds produced by the male frog. On the index fingers of the forelimbs, pads called amphylaxisary pads are present in the male frog. These help in calculation. In the female frog, vocal sacs and amplexary pads are absent. Male Reproductive System The male reproductive system consists of a pair of testes, vas efferentia, and a pair of urinogenital ducts. Each testis is attached to a kidney. Testis is an oval and yellow body. Inside the testis, there are a number of coiled tubules, called seminiferous tubules. Spermatozoa are produced in the seminiferous tubules. Each testis opens into the kidney through 10 to 12 tubes, called vas efferentia. Spermatozoa enter the kidney through these tubes. From each kidney arises a ureter. The two ureter ducts run posteriorly and open into a chamber called cloaca. From the kidneys, spermatozoa enter the cloacae through the ureters. The ureters in the male frog are called urinogenital ducts. The urinogenital duct is common for the passage of urine and spermatozoa. The cloacal chamber is a common chamber for the passage of spermatozoa, urine, and faces or undigested food. It opens to the outside through cloacal aperture. The spermatozoa are microscopic. Each spermatozoan consists of a head, middle piece, and a tail. Head has nucleus, and the thread-like tail helps in swimming. The middle piece connects the head and tail. On the head, there is a small structure called as a chromosome. The acrosome helps the spermatozoon to penetrate into the ovum. Thousands of spermatozoa are discharged in a group. This is called as milt.